came to AI Med um, to learn about artificial intelligence and what's happening in the field of uh, medicine. Um, it's been uh, about three years now since Anthony had the vision of starting artificial intelligence in medicine as a conference, and uh, I've been uh, his partner in developing that vision. And, uh, we've had a tremendous showing in the community. Lots of people are interested in multidisciplinary teams, and we talked about how it's really important to share these types of use cases where artificial intelligence is actually translating into real-world benefit and value and uh, there aren't that many examples so the panel actually had multiple examples of uh, not just systems oncology but other groups also presented their results from using artificial intelligence in medicine and um, this is coming now from science fiction into reality so it was a pretty exciting discussion yeah so uh, during the cognitive computing workshop i had the pleasure of co-chairing that one with sharif terriman uh, who's a neurologist and we first started off with the philosophy of what knowledge is, then we described um, how the brain works and processes information. Uh, the brain is, as you know, one of the most effective machines at translating data into knowledge. So we wanted to understand the basic principles of um, the human mind and how the, the brain translates data into knowledge. Use those basic principles to build cognitive computing systems that do the same. So this conference has been an incredible opportunity to network. Uh, so in addition to learning a lot about what um, some of the other companies are doing and some of um, uh, both technology companies and healthcare organizations and uh, life sciences companies, uh, just an incredible chance to meet individuals. Uh, everything, everybody from uh, technology experts, investors, attorneys who understand how to protect intellectual property around IP, uh, around uh, uh, cognitive computing platforms, for example. Uh, I had a chance to meet academic researchers. Just an incredible eclectic group of people and a uh, tremendous opportunity to network. And I think Anthony set it up that way to, you know, I don't see artificial intelligence in medicine or AI med. I don't see AI med as a conference or an event. I see it more as a movement. And I think the movement requires interaction and networking between that the multidisciplinary group of people. Yeah.